about the sport. Good morning. Hey, how are you guys doing? We good? We're good. All right. So we're hanging out with our Tri City All Stars, and today is National Wiffle Ball Day. So I want to share with you five important things about the game. And the first thing you want to talk about is the creation. So the summer of 1953, a man named David Mullaney in Fairfield, Connecticut, saw his 12-year-old son and some other kids outside trying to play baseball. They had what was called a perforated golf ball and a broomstick. Well, he didn't like that golf ball. Oh, bad pitch. So he realized he could make a perforated ball that's even better. Hey, throw those back, young man. And that is how wiffle ball was started. Then there's the gear. You just need two things perforated plastic ball and a plastic bat or maybe even a broomstick handle <laughs> and that's all you need to get some action going oh oh here we go coming back again oh, oh. now let's talk about <laughs> the field and then the rules the field is really all about playing in confined spaces so you really need about 60 feet which is about 23 to 25 paces that's all you need maybe about eight feet in width for the home runs and that's all. You make your markers for singles, doubles, triples, home runs. Now, when you get to the rules of the game, pretty simple. Oh, any ball that is hit, you catch it in the air, that's an out. You can strike out if you miss three and <laughs> whiff. That's the strikeout. That's where the name oh, wiffle ball comes from. Oh, I see from. what you did there. See what I'm saying? Uh -huh, uh -huh. Oh, and oh. if you hit a grounder and the fielder stops it before the ball stops moving, that's an out. Oh. And if you hit a batter, it doesn't matter. That's your problem. <laughs> <laughs> and then, oh, Woo! the future of the game. Did you know that there is a wiffle ball association? Get out of here. And you can sign up and have your own wiffle ball tournament. Throw that ball back, young man. Have your own <laughs> wiffle ball tournaments in your backyard. They've got three levels. They've got a novice level. They've got a yard league for kind of like medium. And they've got a fast pitch league for the serious players. Yeah, put some pepper on that thing. That's five things you probably didn't know about Wiffle Ball. Enjoy the easiest game of the summer today in celebration. Good day continues after this. Woo!